Hey everyone, so in this video we are going to take a look at one of the services from the Microsoft Fintech called image tagging. So what image tagging is, uh, as the word suggests like we upload the images and it automatically tags those images. So as you can see a Microsoft Fintech makes it easier to find and manage the images in SharePoint document libraries. So what it does, we have the document library created, we upload the image in those document library and AI will automatically tag those images based on the, what is the description so let's say if you upload the image of the cricket then it will scan that image automatically tags in that SharePoint document library so what is the use case and why this is helpful so this is very useful to search, sort and filter so if you have the thousands of images and you want to filter images based on some XYZ criteria then you have the tags right so using the search you can filter the search result using tags as well so here as you can see there are some requirements and some limitations so almost every image type is supported as you can see in the official Microsoft documentation and here are some release notes as well if you want to go with this I will provide these links in the description so let's see it in action so here as you can see I have created one document library called as image library and in that I have uploaded few images so as you can see all these images I have added here uh, we have the columns name created called image tag so this is automatically created we don't need to create this column manually so I'll give an example so let's say first image I have uploaded is the Statue of Liberty right so AI will do it will scan this image and put extract the metadata from that images and put this in the image tag column so as you can see it displays that there is a building cloud outdoor sky and statue so let's say we took a, we take on another example so this is the image of the beach as you can see then when i uploaded that image it tags that image so as you can see there is a beach there is a calm there is a cloud horizon landscape so this kind of tags it automatically generates so for a practical example I'll just up, uh, upload so let's say I have one nature image one car and one ship image so I will just upload those images we don't have to create any models in the backend manually this is the simple service that we need to enable from the M365 admin center so for that you must have the M365 admin or SharePoint admin global admin permissions to enable these syntax services I have already enabled these services that's why uh, it automatically create those tags and those columns as well so let's stay it will take a time to tag those images So after a few minutes as you can see uh, for the first image the tags have been added for the second image as well third image is in still in progress so in this way you can upload the images in the libraries and it will tag so the use case here is so let's say uh, if you have some events in your organization and you have multiple photos taken so what you can do just create a document library upload the e images of the event and it will automatically tag them and the usefulness is you have to search it right so for this we have the search this library feature as well so in this you can see uh, we have the filter option as well so here we have the first one is keywords so keywords are the basically tags so using those tags you can filter the results so let's say I have thousands of images and I want only images whose tag include statue let's say so what I will do I'll just write those keyword the file name here people modified date file type okay so for the statue and only need the photo that means images file type 
and I will just click on search. So as you can see, it automatically filter out the result from all the images, right? So this is very helpful for searching the images. Okay, so this is one of the services which is called image tagging. The second services is the OCR that is optical character recognition. So if you all know that it will uh, scan the let's say handwritten text or scan the images and extract the text from it. So this is as well uh, one of the syntax services that you need to enable and in the official documentation you can find more information which is the supported file types and what are the supported language so I have almost used 20 to 25 different images of different different languages and it almost generate 90 to 95 percent accurate results so this as well I am going to show you so I have put in the same document library so as you can see I have uploaded one image that has some text in it so Microsoft syntax content assembly this is the text in that image so once I upload that image as you can see I got the tags like graphic design graphic screenshot and text but in the extracted text column as you can see it extracted that text which is Microsoft syntax content assembly so for this also you don't have to create any AI models in the backend all automatically generated so this is one of the services it is OCR the licensing and pricing uh, for both image tagging and OCR is different which is based on the how many images and how many characters are there in the OCR and for the images it depends on one image processing takes at the one transaction and you will be charged accordingly so for all the licensing information it is well ex very well explained in the Microsoft documentation so you can go go with it so yeah this is all about the image tagging and OCR services thank you